Calling all my art friends. You know what time it is. It is Tuesday's tip time. Time for a tip that'll help save you time, save you money, or just make you a better artist. And who don't want that? So come on, let's go. So when you're trying to color match something, I have pulled together some of these colors that I think are in this area here. So I'm going to mix them up. I've got like a teal, a cobalt, a Windsor green, and a little bit of pyrrolin green. And I'm trying to match it. And I can't really get it just right, it feels like. So here's what you do. And the reason I may not be able to get it to match is because all of these colors around this area are influencing how I see this color. So what you can do is get your watercolor paper that you're trying to match it on. Cut out a hole punch. Then put it directly over, directly over where you're trying to match. And now I can see that this is much darker than I originally thought it was. So I can continue to just keep mixing until I get the right color. There we go. Now we're getting there. So that's the best way to do it is just to isolate that color away from the other colors that are influencing it by just making a little hole punch in your paper and then match it that way. So follow Art with Viv for more tips, tricks, and tutorials that will help save you time, save you money, or just make you a better artist. Come on now, who don't want that?